Hello everybody. Today is 4th of October 2017. What the hell was that? Crazy bicycler cycling against red. Um, I'm driving this really nice old Volvo FM 340. Just delivered here in Sint Beberi, uh, like north of Stockholm or whatever that is. Look at this van coming, that looks badass. Citroën, what is that? <laughs> Renault, yeah, Renault. Renault traffic. Um, and uh, there was huge traffic back there. Um, huge traffic, man. What's with my English? I would love to say huge. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gonna just try and stop saying that. Uh, so I kind of took this way instead. I never tried taking it this way, but then I noticed on the GPS you could, and uh, Google Maps didn't even suggest it, so now I'm just kind of making up my own way here. Um, so let's try this way instead. Because now it's like it's 6 o'clock, so the rush hour traffic is still here, kind of. Oh, and uh, if you remember my last video where I drove the new Volvo FH500 and I complained about the air suspension out the leveling system, apparently you can just press this stop button here. When you stop at the at your place, you can press that, and then the auto leveling will still work for a few minutes. It seems. So I had no clue about that. So thank you very much for tipping me off about that, and now you guys know as well. So some really nice stuff. I um, I think probably Scania's are kind of the same. Something, some kind of button you press to have the auto leveling, so you can lock the truck and stuff. Uh, so yeah, and I really delivered here in Sundbyberg and uh, now we're driving into the city, Stockholm city, I'm gonna deliver here in, in a garage. Uh, it's already dark out man, but today was a really beautiful day actually. Very sunny. So at least I got some sun on me. I'll just take the right lane, turn left, or I don't know. I'll just <laughs> I'll just keep the left lane, whatever. Okay. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have blocked up the whole circulation. Um. So yeah, I did actually record a full day of work video in Monday, which was really awesome. Driving a Scania G450 and. Uh, the uh, remains of the hurricane 3.5 tons what the fuck this is 3.5 tons oh shit I can't drive here man how could I have not noticed that but the buses are allowed to drive here I guess as soon as I turn around, I guess I won't get any ticket or something. So... Let's try and take some other way, somehow. Whoa! Shit, that's dangerous. 
kind of forgot to um, put it back into drive mode. So, yeah, here we go. Uh, so yeah, it's very dark out already. In the winter, I'll probably work like um, a few day shifts, maybe just to catch the sunlight. Because otherwise, I will like wake up 12 o'clock, go to work too, and then it will be dark, dark already. That's from what I remembered at least uh, from last winter. It's pretty crazy. Still saying I should take this way. Man, I don't drive here often, so I don't know. And why the hell was it like there was like this sign where it says no cars? Hello, that was a very strange sign, man. Very strange. left here and a bit up on the E4 and then turn back into the city. Alright, let's try that, I guess. Can we do that, really? Oh, we're not gonna go on the E4, we're gonna turn straight off there. Man, look at this here. Not, I'm not gonna say huge traffic, no. I would just say it. But, damn, look at this traffic. Oh, okay, so it's left here I should take. Alright, um... That. Or is it some sort of forbidden sign here as well? Oh boy, now you're gonna block up the whole way, huh? Or what are you gonna do? Drive straight through? No, you're gonna block up the whole way for me. Thank you, bus. So kind of you. Oh, with the driving now. Maybe, maybe he'll get in. Well, look at this chaos. <laughs> People honking. Yeah, so I did record a full day of work in Monday, but I can't upload it, man, because um, YouTube has removed its YouTube video editor, it's no longer available. So I'm gonna have to edit the videos together on my own. I know you guys have been coming with some tips on a good, uh, like just rejoining the clips together, and uh, I will try and do that. But then I gotta like not do any mistakes, and so that I don't have to cut out any any parts of the videos. So I will try and do a full day of work and just stitch them together in one of those programs which you guys told me about. Um, but in that video I wanted to edit out a few things I said and such, so um, then when I was done and it was gonna be a 1 hour 20 minute video, I was gonna render it out and it said 9 hours, and I was like, screw that man, I'm not gonna have my computer on for 9 hours just for one video. So I decided I'm not, I'm not gonna upload that video man. It was pretty nice video because uh, it was very rainy and stormy and I showed you guys a lot of stuff but yeah so I just filmed that whole day for nothing. <laughs> you live and learn. Now 
I'm not sure. I can see my eyes are too bad. My eyesight. Oh yeah, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna go in here, man. Somehow. Of course, the ca taxi drivers are like impossible. Oh, nice. That was. That was very different from being a taxi driver. Right, here we go now into the city, finally, I hope. Or maybe in half an hour. <laughs> so they are just used the engine brake lever here. And um, I pushed it into manual, because then it engine brakes even harder when you're in lower speeds. So if you guys were wondering why it's not engine braking, like when you're pushing the lever, it's because you need to like pop it into manual for it to engine brake more. It's very weird. And so yeah, about that auto leveling system, you press this stop button apparently, and and then you can lock the truck, and the auto leveling works. Really nice. Now I know finally. I've been wondering that for a very long time. So, um, actually, I haven't taken my dinner break yet. I'm getting very hungry, but my dinner is all the way down in Yudbro, down there. There's my dinner in the refrigerator. <laughs> so, yeah, I just ate two bananas at least. So I'm just gonna have to suck it up and uh, wait till I get back in the terminal and I'll eat my uh, food as soon as I get back and then I'll empty the truck, I think. And I'll probably do... Wait, where the heck? The GPS has gone wild now. Uh, I forgot what I, what I was gonna say. Quiet! Oh shit, did I just drive against red? No? I hope not. <laughs> oh. that far sounded pretty badass that green Mercedes let's see if it comes here Yeah, before this, um, when I started work 2 o'clock, uh, I got this very broken truck, I got a broken truck and I drove to Skarpnik over here and then I drove back to Yudbro and emptied, no, yeah, I emptied it and then I had to drive it to the Volvo workshop it was one of these kind of trucks it, has, it had its huge warning sign and alarm and everything and it says power reduction check engine so it was a pain in the ass to drive with that alarm going off all the time like duh, 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 duh. but I had to finish the delivery you know so but the truck ran fine so I could finish the delivery and it did have coolant and oil and everything so I don't know what the problem was but now it's at Volvo now it's their problem So yeah, I uh, then got this drive, this truck, to Sundbyberg here, and now I'm driving to Feltavish then, it's called. I don't know if I should keep a right lane here, I think.
nice BMW bike I think it was you see now I can say it BMW <laughs> so thank you for teaching me that I wonder how long I've been recording I'll probably make another video just driving out of the city as well because I know you guys like city driving so now it's just straight straight to the store here all the way over there that's where our place is close to Östermalm right so it's not so exciting you're just driving a straight road in this traffic light after traffic light but on the next video when I'm gonna drive out of here it's probably gonna be more exciting for you guys so make sure you stay tuned for that or check out that video if it's already out Oh, don't forget to check out all the adverts, uh, maybe you see something you like and uh, can support me by doing that. So yeah, this weekend was pretty nice, uh, partying at the Celia line of Maestro, never heard those before but they were pretty crazy. Um, although I gotta warn you guys, if you do decide to come to Stockholm and go on one of those crazy party weekend boats, Celia line, uh, then uh, make sure you bring